Today, you're gonna learn about important video course concepts. These are the things you should do before you create your course. First, you need to know your topic. Your video courses should give students a step-by-step -step guide and good information that truly add value to your student's life. If you don't benefit the student, your course won't be successful and you won't last long on Udemy or the internet. So you wanna make sure that you've lived the life that you're teaching. Show students proof of your experience that you've had. Second, you want your courses to stay relevant for the next three to five years. To be able to last long term. If your course is three years out of date, students will be upset and your course won't last long term. Third, you wanna be disciplined and remain constant and know what you're doing won't be successful overnight. You'll learn things in this course to be able to plant the right seeds. You're in this for the long term. It's gonna to be tough when you start from scratch because you'll have no students and no one knows who you are. Eventually you'll be successful and you'll have a passive income that you can rely on each month for the rest of your life. Because no one knows who you are right now. So you have to give away your products for free. You want to get people to know you. Fourth, have a good promotional video that outlines the exact benefits of what students will learn, how long it might take them to learn it, and for what price. Fifth, you'll learn from your mistakes. You'll make a lot of them. A lot of the decisions that you make will fail. 80% of what I do results in failure. 20% of the things that I do right result in 80% of my profits. Sixth, set your long-term goals whether you want $1,000 profit per month or $10,000 profit per month in passive income. You need to outline specific goals and also include ways that you can achieve these goals. Always be improving. You can always edit these goals because you want to pivot. You might think something will work now, but that might not be the case. So you want to adjust your goals and learn from your mistakes. Seventh, make sure you're unique because people want to remember you. One way to do that is I might act like I'm talking to a friend, have a conversation with them. I try not to be too formal because friendship is a powerful thing. You want to keep your lectures short and to the point. Get to the skill you're teaching and what the benefits are. People want to hear how you can help them. Usually I keep my lectures between three to five minutes long. Use these concepts to emulate them in your own video courses.